Hello, my name is Ivan Rosilko. I am 24 years old. I'm the current Mr. USA 2008. I'm coming at you from Boston, Massachusetts, where I'm getting ready to uh, set sail for Taiwan for the international competition. I'm standing here with Rafa, the director of Critical Beauty, and Erwin, the official stylist of Critical Beauty. Critical Beauty is the producer of Mr. USA pageant, who represents the United States of America to the Mr. International pageant, which this year takes place in Taiwan. We are on the fabled Newberry Street in Boston, Massachusetts, yucking it up, you know. I'm feeling like a celebrity here, I love it, I'm not gonna lie, but uh, we actually, uh, we're just kinda, you know, perusing the street, seeing, uh, you know, what, what can help me out in Taiwan here. We're checking out different stores and whatnot, and just having a great time. How did I get in the world of beauty pageantry? As far as I can remember, I was probably six or seven years of age. I used to play with my sister's dolls, and I would pretend that I was the host of this beauty pageant, and I would select the winner. But for some reason, this hobby never outgrew me. Basically, when I'm not concentrating really on um, doing certain things, like when it comes to the competitions and modeling and all that, uh, I am a fourth year medical student. Um, currently on leave of absence. I jumped on the opportunity. We know why not, it's a good story. Plus it's a free trip to Taiwan if you win. <laughs> Pageant is my biggest passion. And had it not been for my full-time job as a communications consultant, I didn't think I'd be able to uh, sponsor the Mr. USA pageant 2008. Uh, the different categories we'll be competing in, the first one's going to be the international costume, which I was gracious enough to get a sponsor from Harley Davidson. It's a leather outfit. You know, when you think of America, what do you think? You think of Harley Davidson, you know, mean, powerful, sexy. So we incorporate that into an outfit, which is, uh, I, I think, killer. We'll, we'll, we'll see what the judges have to think about that. Also, we'll be doing an evening wear, which I'll be uh, donning a Calvin Klein suit. Uh, it's, it's all, it's basically dark blue, pinstriped, white tie, white shirt. It looks really, really good. I'm really happy with that. And uh, the swimwear, which, I mean, I used to bodybuild, so that's nothing new, you know, prancing around in some skimpy outfit. I have no problem with it. I enjoy it, actually. People have come up to him asking him, you know, are you gay, etc. I mean, I'm not, and I have no problem with it, but you know, I guess that's one thing everybody assumes just being a male model in general. If American women have the opportunity to flaunt their, their beauty, you know, their personality, why not do the same thing with American men? Uh, different things have come my way since being Crown Mr. USA. Uh, you know, people have been recognizing me, which is really, really cool. Other things, uh, different fashion shows and whatnot. If I win Mr. International, I think I'll probably die of a cardiac arrest. If I don't win Mr. International, I'm not going to be too heartbroken because what's the worst that's going to happen? I'm going to become a doctor. You know, that ain't too shabby.